Now, Japan's Prime Minister Fumio Kishida has announced that he will not be seeking re-election as leader of the ruling Liberal Democratic Party next month. Justifying his decision, he said that in the next elections, it was necessary to show the people that LDP is changing and the party is a new LDP. Now, apart from rising living costs and a slumping yen, Fumio Kishida's tenure as Japan's Prime Minister has been plagued by corruption scandals involving his party and the party members. Because of this, support for him has fallen drastically, with approval ratings plummeting to 15.5% in July, the lowest for a Prime Minister in over a decade. Last November, Kishida tried to ease the pressure from inflation and rescue his premiership by announcing a stimulus package worth over $100 billion at the time. According to reports, his move failed to restore confidence among voters in Japan and those within his own party. Battling inflation and spluttered growth, Japan saw its GDP shrink to 0.7% in the first quarter. According to reports, over the past one year, Japanese currency yen has seen one of its lowest performances, falling sharply against the US dollar. Referring to the fundraising scandal that has scarred his cabinet's approval rating, Fumio Kishida said that the, he wants to make a clean break by stepping aside and moving on to support the presidential election, elected as the president of Liberal Democratic Party in 2021. Fumio Kishida's three-year term is set to expire in September. Now, whoever wins the party vote will succeed his, as him as Japan's Prime Minister because the LDP controls both houses of the parliament. The most obvious first step to show that the Liberal Democratic Party will change is for me to step aside. I will not run for the upcoming presidential election. I will continue to support the new leader who will be elected through the presidential election as a comrade. As the head of the organization, I have no hesitation in taking responsibility for a serious situation caused by the Liberal Democratic Party's member. Let's now listen to a few Japanese people who have reacted to their Prime Minister's decision. He probably made the decision because he thought he had no chance to win the Liberal Democratic Party leadership race. It's a time for transition of power between generations. Kishida probably wanted to do more. So I'm sure he's disappointed, but I think it was a great decision. Personally, I wish he continued a little bit more as Prime Minister. Maybe he was stressed with the low ratings, and with all the circumstances around him, I guess he has no choice but to step down. I hope the economy and people's lives will get better with the new Prime Minister. Also with what's going on in Ukraine and China, someone that will strengthen our national defence is needed. For all the latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.